morning everybody today is wednesday it's about what time is it 7 31 a.m so gagawa po tayo ngayon ng breakfast smoothie so ang aking ingredients for our smoothie is acai so hindi ko po alam kung alam ninyo itong acai you're familiar with this but acai is really good we got this one at albertson but they said acai is one of the super food. It says it has antioxidant and fiber and it is really good for you. So it has a lot of benefits. So we always mix this one on our smoothie. So we got this one at Albertson. Oh, nasabi ko na yun. And sometimes we get it at uh, Costco too. So since hindi kami nakapunta sa Costco, alam ni na. So we just got it at Albertson. Yeah, that's acai and I'm putting uh, strawberries. Strawberries and we still have one mango left. This one is from Costco too, but this is the only one left. And we're gonna put banana and we're gonna mix it with um, honey yogurt. So, para may, may konting tamis na honey. And we had a fresh pineapple. We're gonna mix a little bit of that. Okay, so we're gonna start with our mango. Hope it's ripe. Oh, yes, looks good. All right, that looks good. Yes, kamusta po kayong lahat yaan? Let me know kung ano po yung favorite na smoothie ninyo. You can share your uh, recipe of smoothie so I can try it. And of course, I need to drink coffee. Excuse me, thank you. <laughs> I'm gonna get spoon. So I can scoop this mango. Okay. Oh. That's the color you want for mango. It's like deep orange, deep yellow. I don't know, but it smells sweet, smells good. It reminds me of the Philippines. I love mango. Kamusta po sa lahat ng mga tao sa Pilipinas? Sana po okay kayo lahat yan. So. Uh -huh. Cameraman ko po ang aking anak, Dewey, because he loved this smoothie. He loves smoothie for breakfast. So as daddy, I usually put uh, granola with my smoothie. I just don't drink it. I put granola on it. But at least mabigat gets a chan. So, right there. And we're just gonna add this strawberries there and i have this acai here ganito po ang itsura niya splash on my face sorry okay madulas ang aking kamay we go. Just gonna drop it here. I'm gonna break it a little. Right there. So, and then our banana. Ripe banana is good. Just break it apart like this. Alright, garbage in the sink. And just a little bit of our pineapple because I am not in uh, uh, but it's good it's sweet though so I'm gonna wash my hands so I can start blending it using our blender oh I forgot I still need to put the uh, yogurt two maybe one more there oh, 
and then we're gonna blend it. Ah, medyo maingay po. So. It's ready. Let's try it. Okay. Right here. Look at that. Wow. Okay. Can we try it, do we? Okay. Wanna try it? Mmm. It's delicious. It's really refreshing. Here, I'll hold this one and my son will try it. She don't want me to show her face in the camera. Good? All right. So, yan po ang ating smoothie. Hi, magandang umaga po sa inyong lahat. Welcome back po sa ating channel, Pio Am Cooking and Couponing. Today po is kind of medyo makulimlim sa labas. It's kind of gloomy outside and it rain a little bit, sprinkled a little bit and it's just kind of gloomy. So we are back here in the kitchen and we're gonna make the no-bake cheesecake. So for all those cheesecake lovers like me, this is the dessert for you and it's so easy you don't have to bake it and there's only like one two three four ingredients and we're just gonna mix it together and then let it set and then we're just gonna put toppings whatever toppings you want so this one I learned this one at first from my friend um, she brought some and we tried it and I really like it it's not too cheesy it's not too sugary it's just dry and then I asked where did you get it did you make it by yourself she said that she got it from Pinterest so I searched it on Pinterest and I found it and I tried it and I let my family try it and they love it even my uh, son which is you know love dessert at first he don't like cheese anything that has cheese he don't like but with this one he loves it. Every time I make this one, it will not last for three days. So we're gonna start by uh, mixing our cream cheese. These are our ingredients, cream cheese and a cool whip and sugar. We're gonna use one third cup of sugar and then we're gonna use this uh, already, what do you call this daddy? <laughs> The graham, graham crack crackers crust. Graham cr I don't know what it is in Tagalog. Yeah. So we're gonna put this cream cheese here. This is so easy, guys. Very easy, but it's really good. I promise you. You have to try this one and let me know if you like it because I like it. <laughs> and it's really easy to make. So how many times I said that? Because it's really easy. So, we're just gonna put this cream cheese right here. Alright. And then we're gonna add the one third cup of sugar. A little more than one third cup. There you go. And then we're just gonna 
bit this one in our mixer. We have electric mixer here. Okay, and we're using this puddle. You can use the whisk, I guess, but I kind of just wanted to use this one. You want to show here, Daddy, so you can see? By the way, our uh, cream cheese are in room temperature as well as our cold whip. Just whip that one until it is uh, mixed together, cream together. Alright, now we're gonna add the whipped cream. Alright, so easy, right? Ah. Let's turn that off for a bit. Ooh, I think I'm gonna put this down. I don't want messy. Alright. Let's just put this. We're just going to mix it. Okay, some more. This will not take you a lot of time to prepare dessert. Dessert. Okay. Just gonna blend it together. Okay, there you go. Let me wash my hands first. Just gonna blend it together and it's ready. I hope you guys uh, give this a try because it's really easy and it's really good. When you're craving for cheesecake, this is the one that you want to do. It will take no time to make it. And it's not too sweet either. So, so we're gonna prepare our graham cracker crust so we can go ahead and put our uh, cheesecake. There you go. Okay, we're just gonna put this. Just gonna flatten it a little bit. And we have a cheesecake, guys. We're gonna put this in the fridge to let it set. And then when it's set, maybe four to six hours. And then after that, we're gonna top it with uh, strawberries because strawberries are season uh, this year. Is that right? They're in season right now. Yeah, they're in season right now. So. Uh, I got some strawberries and we're gonna slice it later and we're gonna put it as our toppings and um, 
I'll see you back later guys when we are ready to put our strawberries for our toppings. Hello, Thank welcome you. back po. Andito ulit tayo sa aming kitchen. Ito na yung cream cheese natin. It's been only 3 hours. So, hindi na kami makakapaghintay ng 4 hours or 6 hours. So, sisintensyahan na natin to. So, I'm just gonna uh, slice these uh, strawberries and then we're gonna put it on the top of the cake. Now, you can use uh, any kind of uh, fruits you want, you know, if you want to try mango. Because there's season in the Philippines right now, you can try mango. Or raspberry, blueberries. What else? Um, banana? Banana, yeah, that's right. I love banana. But since this is the fruit that we got, so we're going to top it with uh, strawberries. And we'll see if it's there already. Because <laughs> my son already asked me two times if the cake is already done or not. So, oh, we'll try. If it's not set, we're still gonna eat it. Okay? Almost done, guys. So, cross your, cross your finger. Hopefully, it is set. There you go. <laughs> Good job, daddy. So again guys, if you're not subscribed yet, hit that subscriber button below so that you are a member of our community. Uh, supportahan po natin ang ating channel. Alright, this is the last one. I'm almost done. Alright. Hands rinse <laughs> and dry, of course. Alright, you guys are ready? I am ready. How about you, Dewey? Are you ready? Alright, He's ready. It's <laughs> <laughs> a camera shot. So it's a little, it's not a little, I mean, it's not quite set yet, but who cares, right? Alright. Oh boy. Isn't that beautiful? I wish my friend will see this because this is our favorite cheesecake when it comes to cheesecake. All right, you guys ready? So hopefully that will come in one piece. <laughs> the first one is always the hard one to get. Oh, that's why I get this one. I'll use this. Ooh, oh my goodness, it's not set yet or what? What do you think? Right there. Is it good? Looks good? All right, I got a thumbs up. So hopefully guys, you give me a thumbs up too, like my husband did. <laughs> okay, let's see. Do you want more? Strawberry on top? No, thank you. Oh, no, thank you? Okay. There you go for Dewey. Mommy see. turn on. <laughs> Do you want some, too, Daddy? Yes, please. All right. Just a small one? Mm-hmm. I'll look you guys. Okay. Mug and dog on, friends. <laughs> Shout out daw po sa lahat ng aking kapamilya sa Pampanga. Shout out po sa nanay ko. Nay, sana andito ka. Oh, para matikman mo to. Ang sarap-sarap. Yeah, made po ni Bay. Sana po okay kayo diyan. Mag-iingat po kayo lagi. Ayan, more strawberries for David. Yan. 3 hours lang po ito sa fridge. So, hindi pa masyadong nag-set. So, medyo magalaw pa siya. So, babalik natin sa fridge. Tapos, tatagdagan na lang natin uli ng strawberries. So, ayan na po mga kaibigan ang ating easy, no bake, less ingredients cheesecake. And give this a try guys. Hindi ako mapapahiya sa inyo. Well, of course, you know where to find it. So, hanggang sa muli po mga kaibigan. Don't forget subscribe. Like gives it a thumbs up so that we I can produce more um, videos.
video for you guys. So stay safe, stay healthy, and God bless po. Hanggang sa muli. Bye!